Okay, 16 gauge wire, just like my leads. Speaker wire. This is copper solid, so it doesn't matter. You can use any speaker wire you got just in case it's warm. This is the fifth time I made this video because I'm not covering it enough. Okay, the wound folded 16 foot and a half, 8 foot on each side, quarter wavelength. This is my L1. It's 14 gauge wire. It has to be heavier than your L2. Same thing here 20 gauge, 16 gauge. I miniaturized it, it worked. All right. This is actually a Tesla hairpin circuit for Don Smith. That's the way I see this. This is super high frequency. And this thing is blowing amperage and flamed up. And I'm going to show you. And I hope this is the last time I got to show you make this video. Okay. Uh, oh, Brian P. inspired me to get back and play with a lot more stuff. I've been really busy. I really had no time for anything. And I've been thinking a lot and I've been playing a lot lately. So... I'm going to show you this. This is, um, hold on, I'm trying to get this right. This is burnt through from just tapping this. This thing is hot because I've been playing with it, arcing it like crazy. 12 volt battery, ZPS driver. This doesn't, I put my sunglasses down before I blind myself again. This don't do it justice. If you see me jumping, I'm looking through the camera. Just going to, ooh, look at that. Look at, look, 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 glowing red. How hot is that? You well with this damn thing. That's it. Turn that off. I hope you find this helpful. Brian P. Look his channel up. And I will run this like Don Smith was running his device, dumping it into caps and running it into a transformer and taking it down from there. Uh, I still really don't know how I'm going to feed this. Oh, by the way, you can earth ground this. You earth ground this, you get a different, different potential on all this. Just to let you know. I'm inside. It's raining again. So uh, I hope you find this helpful and I hope everybody's happy. Thank you.